Hey everybody, exciting day here at Life Elevated Trailers. We've got this new contractor grade LXT trailer is the model name of this model. And then this has the Millhouse package, which comes with these CNC cut heavy duty ladder racks, the heavy duty ladder on the front and the um, storage doors that are passed through on the outside for quickly passing tools in and out and quick access to your tools inside the trailer. Obviously another cool part of this trailer has a walk-on roof, 12 inch on center roof bows with a three eighths dry max roof underneath for added support. On the back of this roof, you've got a roller so you can roll your ladders off the back to your guys down below or just to the ground. I'll show you that right now. So we've got our ladder up here and just grab this thing. As Jace comes around the back, you'll see you've got this tube here. So if you've got a heavy ladder, it just rolls right off the back of this tube, comes down. This with a heavy ladder on it will roll so that you don't have to grind everything down off the back. The ladder on the front of this trailer is not your rink -a dink RV ladder. This is a full width, wide, strong, and safe ladder for going up and down multiple times a day. It's not something that gives under your weight, that bends, that moves all over the place. Also, small thing, notice the width on it. Your feet aren't together as you're coming down this. You can keep a stable base if you're trying to carry something up it. Moving forward, this is a heavy duty trailer. You got an eight inch tube steel frame on this. Not a six inch, not a dinky four inch. This is the real deal as far as weight capacity, along with an adjustable coupler that can be moved up and down to match the, the hitch height on your truck. Um, furthermore, drop leg, 5,000 pound, heavy duty jack so that you can drop a leg out. You're not cranking the handle for 10 years trying to get your, tra your trailer up and down off your truck. When you're doing it every day, that really adds up in time. Moving back and talking about the, the weight capacity again, tandem 7,000 pound axles. It's a 14,000 pound rated trailer. The trailer itself is about 4,000 pounds. So you've got 10,000 pounds of cargo capacity that this beast can handle. 16 inch on center tube steel in your walls, 16 inch on center, big C channel under your floor to distribute the weight. So that this thing, no matter what you need to haul in it, it can handle it, get you to the job site for years and years. The really cool part about this trailer is the flow through access. So these storage lockers here from the outside of your trailer can also be accessed from the inside of the trailer. When you open this door from the inside, you can pass tools and materials in and out of the trailer without having to go in and out of it every time. All of these open and all of them are passed through. Work top right here for just setting stuff down when you need to do some quick drawings or whatever. And again, your last cabinet here. This trailer comes with a 30 amp power pack on it from the factory. So you've got your 110 outlets inside, your 110 lights for a true um, mobile work workstation and then on your barn doors brand new sometimes the weather stripping is thick and you have to push, shut these hard over time they wear in and shut easier um, but it just has thick weather stripping on it your doors metal holdbacks on these barn doors so you can pin them in place and pin them open so you're not worried about them swinging when you're on the job site they really thought this trailer out. Um, one, of the, one of the features that people just love is this back porch. It doesn't look like much, right? But what it does is it cuts 10 inches off your step when you go into the trailer. So instead of having to do this every time you get in your trailer, you're coming to here. So you're not killing your knees going in and out of your trailer all day long, carrying stuff. It takes your step height in half, which is a huge deal over time, wear and tear on your body. Heavy duty drop down stabilizer jacks in the rear. So when you get to a job site and you need this thing to be solid, drop your tongue down. So the trailer's like this, drop those heavy duty jacks out the back and then jack the trailer back up and put pressure on those. And then you've got a trailer that's sitting there solid, not gonna be wobbling around when you're trying to do precise cuts inside the trailer or precise you know, work. You don't have a trailer that wants to move on you while you're doing it. Coming inside, You've got a heavy duty three quarter inch floor, seven sixteenths dry max walls. All this wood 
is very water resistant. You can pressure wash this trailer out if you need without doing any extra sealing or coating. Salem vents on the side that push and pull, depending on if you wanna grab air or push air out. And then you've got fluorescent lights in the roof, um, along with 12 volt. If you're not around 110 power, you do have 12 volt light as well. And then you've got two outlets for charging tools or anything else you need. And then as I was saying, the pass through doors. So this, well, let's show this one because that one's shut on the outside. On the outside. It's a great example of it. This comes down. And if you need to just get stuff out of the trailer quickly, you can access it from the outside, from the inside. And all of these doors are built that way. These are full aluminum welded and adjustable shelving. So you can move your shelves inside up and down. This is an aluminum countertop. It's solid. It's not some cheap flimsy piece that's gonna give out. All this stuff is built to work. And that's the whole goal of this trailer is it's built to work. You can take this thing with you every single day, throw your stuff in and out of this a million times, hammer all of these components and they're gonna stand up to the abuse. E-Track integrated in your wall already. So if you need to strap things to the wall, you've got this piece of E-Track here that's welded to a plate into the frame. Really strong piece, can take a ton of weight. As you saw me walking on the roof, 12 inch on center tube steel, three eighths um, dry max between the roof and the roof bows. Same that's on the walls. Coming forward, you've got an expandable 110 port here. You still have one more fuse that you can throw in here, one more breaker and add whatever other 110 you would need. Um, and then another Salem vent here on the front. This trailer has LED lights, radial tires, um, bonded exterior, you know, full tube steel framing. There's really no corners cut. There's nothing that this trailer would necessarily need that it doesn't already have. Um, give us a call here at Life Elevated Trailers. We can help outfit one however you need it. And uh, we're super excited about this new option.